So, after a few days of waiting, my PCBs arrived and it's time to start soldering them. Because I didn't want to show my phone number, I put a little sticker over my contact details. I'll start off with the 0805 capacitors and resistors. To make the process easier, I put some liquid flux on the soldering pads. By the way, nobody told me that soldering with a camera in front of your nose is three times as difficult. Because I wasn't 100% sure I was using the right values, I checked my capacitors with a little SMD multimeter. With the help of a USB microscope, I could check my first results. But as you might see, it's not entirely perfect yet. My cheap Chinese hot air soldering iron will help me to get everything perfect. Next up is the AT-Tiny microcontroller, 
but if you've read my blog, you know that I've used the wrong footprint on the PCB. Luckily, there's an easy way to solve this. If I push them on my desk sideways, the pins will bend and they will fit perfectly. I start by soldering one of the eight pins. And after I check the position of the other pins, it's ok to continue with the rest. Before I continue with the rest of the PCB, I check my microcontroller by programming the bootloader using my ISP programmer. Time for the most exciting part of the electro card, the OLED display. The OLED display is held in place using some double sided tape. Once again I start by soldering the first pin to the PCB, but in this case I also solder the last one. This will keep the ribbon cable in place. Next I will solder all the other pins, but as you can see my camera work failed a little bit over here. Soldering this ribbon cable is more easy than you think. Just swipe some liquid solder through the soldering flux. Soldering the battery holder is a little bit of a challenge. 
it requires some extra heat before your solder flows. And now the moment we've all been waiting for. Programming the microcontroller. And as you can see, it works perfectly. It can even show you the voltage of the battery. And even better, it has a small easter egg. But more about that in a future blog or video.